I am just headed down from where I camped last night on top of Priest Mountain. Pretty spot. And it's just after 6 o'clock. I wanted to get an early start. I don't have that far to go. I think I could go like 15, 17, 18. There's, we intersect the Blue Ridge Parkway again, and there's a bunch of crossings, all of them a couple miles apart. So depending on hard the, how hard the day is, I could get off probably at any one of those um, because I've heard from one of my friends up ahead that this section is really, really rocky. A lot of rock scrambling. One of the hardest climbs of the trip so far, something called Three Ridges. And there's a lot of comments in the trail notes too about how difficult it is. Um, so we'll see how the day goes, depending on how far I, will depend how far I go. Um, though I'm hoping everyone experiences things differently out here. I found that someone will say, something's easy or not that bad and then i'll experience it and go whoa that was difficult <laughs> and just the opposite too someone will say how bad something is and i won't think it was so everyone just has a different experience a lot of times but again we'll see how it goes i'll let you know supposedly most of the day it's already starting most of the day is going to be on rocks and also some hand over hand and rock scrambling Looks like it might be a nice view coming up. That's all one farm, but that is a picturesque farm and picturesque fields. That's towards the east, just after seven o'clock. This is Cripple Creek on my way down from Priest Mountain. But Cripple Creek, I now have the song by the band in my head. I don't know if that's the name of the song, but up on Cripple Creek. I get that out of my head, it's stuck in my head now. <laughs> this is the Thai River and the Thai River Suspension Bridge. I always love these suspension bridges. I don't know why, I'm just amazed by the work that must have got into it. And then, let's see if this one shakes. I always like to they go up and down for some reason. Yep, there it goes. I don't know if you can see it shaking if I stop. <laughs> that river is a pretty big river. Here you can see the bridge shaking. <laughs> I don't know why <laughs> I find it funny.
And I'm just starting up the three ridges climb and the beginning of the rocks. Can't video for long ago. <laughs> uh, kill myself and break another pole, which I don't want to do that. But you get the idea. Yep, going up there. I believe that's the, uh, the top of the priest over there that I came down off of earlier this morning. And I'm about halfway up uh, three ridges mountain. Nice little valley there with some houses. So I came down off of there and now I'm about halfway up three ridges and sort of on a little break from the rocks which is nice. Not too bad right now. Probably hard to see this, how steep it is, but Going up there. Apparently this is the top of three ridges. No view. It was really steep and rocky. I saw a little bit of it coming up. I don't know if it was the hardest climb that I've had so far on this through hike. Um, seems like whatever hike you're on at the moment or whatever climb you're on at that moment that's the hardest one but it certainly was very steep very rocky and it was almost four miles long but actually i'm more concerned with the downhill here i think what i'm hearing it's just as rocky on the downhill which is actually even harder um, just have to be much more careful on the downhill whenever i fall and it's always been on the downhill so far the climb down off of three ridges this is not too bad. Looks like a cool overlook here. I always like those farms. It almost looks like a winery down there. I always like the farms that are, you can just see open space and then surrounded by nothing but miles of trees. Or like that. I think that's that same little valley I had a picture of before. And that, I believe, is the priest over there. So, came down there and then up. And I think that would sort of be, I don't know, one, two, three, three ridges. The summit is back up there. I came all the way along those that ridge line down there and back up there is where I camped last night. That'll do it for day 65. You see the cars going by. I'm back near the Blue Ridge Parkway after ever many miles. And I believe Mrs. Mulligan is here. Yay! With cold beverages and trail magic. End of day 65.